The first major technology that disrupted what we know of reproduction was IVF. Now, IVG, or in vitro gametogenesis, has created possibilities far beyond what IVF offered, the possibility to turn any cell in your body into a sperm or an egg. My first introduction to IVG was from the person who developed the technology, Shinya Yamanake. He at that time had told me that it could be possible to change a skin cell into a sperm or egg cell. I thought it was gonna be really far into the future, and I was surprised at how quickly we're at this discussion now. Development now is dynamic, it's not just one way. You can take normal cells like a blood cell or a brain cell that are fully committed to just doing one thing, and then say, you can go back to school. You can go back up the chain, become developmentally something much younger, a stem cell, and then go down a different path. Stem cells are like blank pages that can be rewritten. In the case of IVG, they take a new path to become reproductive cells, the building blocks to make a baby. All of these technologies are unnatural. Chemotherapy is unnatural. Eyeglasses are unnatural. It's not natural versus unnatural. For me, it's ethically unnatural or unethically unnatural. It's all unnatural. <laughs>